Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Firstly, to start this video off, I do want to apologise for not filming in a while. Um, I've just had my ups and downs, and obviously I've had nothing to record on. I am recording on my brother's iPad, which he did buy off my mother, which used to be mine, but um, never mind that. Also, mind my makeup, especially my eyeliner, because I can't do eyeliner and save my life, so it's just practising. But I just chucked this makeup on just to do this video because my skin's not exactly been the great at the moment. But anyway, on this video, as you can tell by the title, it is um, a haul. I thought I'd bring something back that you'd be interested in. Um, so I thought I'd bring a haul and I did do a little shopping. So I just want to show you that. This should be another video next week. Um, also, comment down below if you want to start seeing blogger mail videos I have had that idea of Amber like she does really good ones I'll pop her um, channel down below also my, my hand is brown don't know if you can see that I've been playing with fake tan um, and my, my hand's gone brown so just ignore that and also mind the way I'm dressed I and mean, my dressing gown come freezing um, but yeah comment down below if you want to see any videos when I get enough posts for blogger mail and also Post below if you want to see what I got for Christmas this year as well. Um, but enough of the rambling, I'm going to get on with this video because it's not going to be too long and I haven't got much stuff anyway. So I'll start off with what I got in Poundland. Um, I got one thing from Poundland and this is for my giveaway that I will be having in the new year. Um, I do have like a box of stuff like right now for the giveaway and I also have like a makeup bag as well. Um, so I'm just trying to get things in and then. I will definitely do one but I got this eyeshadow by Barry M also sorry about my lighting it's in eyeshadow 4 which is a purple or a brown a brown like a really dark brown um, I just bought this because obviously Barry M is really expensive um, but Poundland do like makeup that we get from like we get they get it from other countries like America China wherever and they sell it there so obviously we can get their makeup then but I've got this hasn't even been open and I'm putting this in my giveaway for next year the next two things I've got of eBay um, they're just random things and um, the first one is another thing for my giveaway and it's the Heng Fang Balm lipstick it looks like this it was like 99p um, and I've never tried these lipsticks in my life so I don't know what they're like, sorry guys. But this is in the colour 142. Um, it, for some reason it didn't come with a seal, which I've contacted the seller, tell them that normally when I get lipsticks in the post from eBay, they have a seal, but it didn't. Um, just to prove to you, has it been swatched or anything? It's just this lovely pink colour. It's like a nice pink. Um, I know most people wear more reds than that, but I could only get pink at the time, so I'll probably get a few more of those to put in the giveaway as well. And then I got this, somebody, normally you can get these in like a 12 pack, but I just wanted one colour, I didn't want like the whole 12 pack, and this is the True Lips by Me Now, um, as you know I've got Me Now liquid lipsticks, which I did have a review on it, I did ages ago on the lipsticks, um, but I got the True Lips lip liner pencil in 06, and it's this lovely like, it's like a, I'd say like it's a nude red, I don't know, what would you, like a nudie bendy pink? But I'll swatch it on my hand for you. They're like really creamy. So this is the colour. It's really nice. I do have a lipstick that will go with actually. So I just can't wait to try that out because by that it looks really good. So I got that. I didn't really buy the next products. I had them given to me by my mum. She got them free with her Avon kit. Because I think when in her last Avon catalogue, she spent so much she got like a free goodie bag and these were in a goodie bag so she passed them on to me um so i got this avon true colors eyeshadow quad in model this is the modern romance collection i've never really seen this collection in the catalog so i'm glad i've got it um i've actually got one of these colors on my eyes today because i thought i'd do my eyes um i've got number three on today this oh, let me cover the mirror up. i've got number three on today it looks like gray in the the Pan, but it's actually like a, like a really dark brown when you put it on your eyes and it just comes with like a nice white a nice like lilac grey a nice purple and a nice like browny greyish colour 
and the mirror on this is amazing this is why i've been using to do my makeup because if you didn't know i do live back with my mum and if you didn't know before i did move away from my mum's i move back from my mum's back to my mum's now um so um she packed all my stuff and that for where to take with me but obviously i've moved back and now i've like left all my makeup brushes and most of my makeup over where i was living before so i've got to get that back so i've been using this mirror to just do my makeup in so i got that i can't tell you how much she's retailed for because i'm not too sure i've got them in a goodie bag but normally they retail about from what i've seen six seven pound maybe cheaper the next one i got is the avon true color in teal attitude um i'm not really fussed on colors anymore like before i was really fussy on what colors i had in my collection but to be honest with you i just like having a bunch of colors in my collection now because i think it's cool this one's just a two a dual one and this comes with like a champagne peachy color it's coming off more like like a white on there like a blue which i think is really nice so I'm not too sure if you meant to use them together or is that just like a palette that you've got two colours in. And then the last one I got off her was the quad again from True Colours and it's in khaki style. So I'm guessing this is all greens because normally when people say khaki it's green, isn't it? So yeah, this is all greens. Um, so you have stuff like this. So you have like, you have two greens at the bottom, like you have a khaki green. That's more of like a black. Then you have like a champagne colour and then a white, which I think is really good. I love having packs like this in my collection because you always have like different shades in them. And I just think they're really, really good. So I got those. Next, I went into Super Drag. I didn't have much money because I did have like Christmas shopping to do as it is Christmas next Sunday and I'm so, so excited. Um, but I bought some things for the giveaway and I bought my th some things for myself because I thought, why not get stuff in for the giveaway now? Um, so I'll start off with Makeup Revolution. Now, there's two things I, I've never seen in Makeup Revolution collection. I don't know if anyone else has seen these in their Super Drug or not, but uh, I don't know if they're new. But this is the Makeup Revolution Give Me Power um, duo, and I got it in the shade Can't Escape Me. And basically, it's a, like a sparkly lip gloss at the bottom. I'm not going to do it because this is for the giveaway. Uh, a sparkly glittery pink um, lip gloss at the bottom and at the top it's a pink lipstick and I thought if you're going on a night out um, and you want to take a lip lipstick with you but you also like lip gloss on top as well this would be really great and also it's just something nice to have in your collection it's something that you don't really have and not many brands have out at the moment so I got that and I think that cost me about six pound I've lost my receipt and I bought these a couple of days ago so I think that cost me about six pound don't quote me on that and the next thing i bought is uh the super well high gloss lip color stick which is what i have on my lips right now guys and it's not glossy at all it's actually really matte like literally as soon as you put it on your lips it's matte and i don't normally go over reds guys as you know i'm more of my nu a nude lip girl um but i i just love this red it's like gorgeous and they had like this color um, like a purpley colour and like a pink and I didn't want purple because I got loads of purple lipsticks and I never wear them I just get purple lipsticks because it's my favourite colour and um, the pinks I don't really wear either so I thought I'll give it a red and give them a go and if I like them I'll pick up the other colours anyway and basically it's from the I Love Makeup range this cost me about £5 I believe maybe cheaper but the stick looks like this and then it's just this and it is rotatable at the bottom but it's just like a crayon basically um, and so you put on your lips it turns really really matte I absolutely love it it's definitely a great great colour great great lipstick and I think this is part of the Makeup Revolution range like the I Love Makeup but I got this in the colour Call Me so do so go and check those out and then lastly I got something for the um, giveaway and it's a palette um, and it's the Makeup Revolution Redemption Palette Essential Mattes. Now it does look a bit dusty because I did end up and scratch to death because I've left my bag into like one corner and I've been chucking stuff on it, forgetting it was there and chucking things in the bag to get to just put it aside and it's me. But you get all these mattes, sorry about the glare, but you get they're all matte, but you get like a range of colours like your browns, you've got your blues, you've got your like like base colours. 
and I just think it's a really good like palette to have in your collection especially if you're more starting off on makeup and you just want mattes you don't want to start with sparkles I'm more of a matte girl because I don't really like sparkly stuff the only type of sparkles I like is like, it's like a champagne colour just to put on your eyelids just to make your like your inner like I can't speak today guys sorry I can't get used back used to fit doing again but like make your crease colour stand out more um, that's the only type I like but if it's my crease colour I really like it matte next is from freedom now as you know i've only got like one freedom product and that's my um i'll just get out my drawer if i can find it here you go it's my uh freedom pro glow um pink cap blusher and bronzer together i've never i've like only swatched this i've never like got into it so i'm gonna start using that but basically i've bought this color because it was like the lightest colour they had there, the rest of the lightest colours were sold out. Um, and mainly because I'm going to start tanning. I'm going to try and start tanning, as you can tell, I've been messing around with fake tan. Um, I'm going to start tanning and I want a foundation that's going to match my skin a bit more, just to darken me up to match my my tan. Like, I'm only going for a light tan, I'm not going for a full blown dark tan. Because obviously I'm just starting off. But I got the Freedom Pro Matte Longwear Foundation in Matte 4. Um, and apparently it leaves your skin with a flawless matte finish that will shine and bay all day um, It looks pretty light um, But I'm probably guessing it's quite dark By the looks of it anyway So there's a little swatch of it No, it's actually quite light guys like Don't know if you see that it's quite light so I may have to go up a shade darker but um this didn't cost me too much i can't remember how much it cost me but i think it was like about to the four between the four and seven pound mark this cost me obviously you know how much the Make revolution palettes cost me um next i'm going to go on to makeup academy which is mua now i bought one thing well two things for myself and the first one is the makeup revolution translucent pressed powder now on YouTube, I hear everybody rave about this powder, like people are rebuying it just because it's that good. Um, I got mine in translucent if I didn't just say. Um, so I thought, why not just pick it up? And in my super drug, I don't know if it's in every super drug, but I've got three for two on MUA products at the moment. So I picked some stuff up um, and I bought this. So. I can't wait to try it out to be honest because I just want to see what the rave is about and see if it's actually pretty good. And then also I bought another one as well for you guys which is the pressed powder and I've got this in shade 2 which is a bit dark, like it is quite dark so I'm sorry if you win this you it doesn't match your, your shade but maybe if you're like a tanner like me you can use it. Um, it doesn't look that dark on camera but in person it's like orange <laughs> but if you do win the giveaway next year then I'm sorry but I did buy that. And they weren't like expensive either, like they're, they're affordable. The next thing I bought is one of their lipsticks and I got it in Barely There. And it's just like a nice nudey pink colour. Um, I got this for the giveaway as well. And I just thought it'd be nice for someone to have a nice lipstick in their collection. Especially like a nudey pink. Um, obviously because nude's my favourite colour. Um, but I didn't want to just buy someone a nude in case they didn't like it. So I got like a... A bit of a pinky colour as well so I got that and they're a pound I love these lipsticks they're just a pound um, next I got an eyeshadow from them and this is for me um, the eyeshadow in Chamoisy I can't pronounce that but it's this nice like shimmery brown colour now as I said I don't go for shimmery brown colour to my crease but I thought I'd mix it up a bit and try going shimmer a bit more so I got this colour, um, I will swatch it, oh my god that's so soft, so it's more like a gold, so this is what it looks like, a nice like brownish gold colour, but I thought why not even if I don't use it for the crease, if I don't use it for the crease, um, then I can just use it as a base colour basically. And the last thing I bought was this cupcake blusher. From MUA. Now this is all smashed up as I said as you can see around there. 
Um, I'm not too sure if this is the blush I got from MUA. Um, let me just check and buy my makeup drawer. So I'll just quickly check. No, I got Candy Floss in MUA for my other one. So I will be keeping this one myself and I'll probably pick you guys up one anyway because they're only a pound. Um, but it's all kind of smashed up. I don't want you guys to have a smashed up one. So I got this in Cupcake and it's just a nice uh, pinkish blush and I can't find the tape to it. I hate it when they tape things down. My super drug started to tape their like, things down now because people are like swatching the actual product that people are going to buy. So this is the colour of it. Let me find a... So it's just a nice pinkish colour. I'm sorry about my hands guys, they're disgusting. I don't know if you're going to see that, but it's like this like, pinky colour. So I got that, and that's a pound. And that is actually everything I bought guys. So if you did enjoy this video, I know it was kind of crappy because I am trying to get used to filming again. Um, do give it a thumbs up. If you are new to my channel, then don't forget to press the subscribe button. Um, it's either up here if you're on a desktop or down here. And if you're on a iPad or an iPhone, it's normally underneath the video. Um, but if you already subscribed, as I said, like this video. Leave me a comment about if you want to see what I got for Christmas this year and if you'd like to start seeing blogging mail videos for the for the blog like, what I get for the post. Um, then let me know if you want to do those below. Um, it feels so nice to be back filming as well because I've missed it so much. Like it used to help me with my anxiety and that, and I feel so much comfortable doing it like this way. Like I'm, I don't care about my surroundings. Normally when I'm just sat there, I'm like thinking, what was that noise? What's this? What's that? But filming, it just calms me down and it makes me focus. But anyway, if you do like this video I said, give it a thumbs up. If not, then do let me know down the description what I could change. But I will see you in my next video, guys. Bye.